Right, we're here in the splendid surrounds of Middleham Castle with local trainer Mark Johnston. Uh, Mark, we're right in the middle of one of the busiest periods of the season, but you're already looking forward to it a little bit later. You look like mounting a pretty good challenge for the St Ledger this year. Yeah, I think it's certainly uh, with four entries and two of them you know, proven at, at Group 1 level already, um, I think we've got a serious chance. You know, DXB um, obviously a little bit disappointing since he's second in the derby, but looking like he's crying out for further and for a bit of cut in the ground and should get both in the St Ledger. So he's a very, very serious contender. Mildenberger, second in the Dante. Um, he's had a few little setbacks and hasn't run since, uh, but hopefully he'll be back on track well in advance of the St Ledger and is another horse proven at, at that level. Um, so two very, very serious contenders. And then I've got two sort of shot in the dark possibilities that are uh, an Austrian school who's running in handicaps, although he ran in second in the Glasgow Stakes the other day. Uh, but rated 98, so quite a bit of improvement needed before you could consider him a St Ledger candidate, but not impossible when he steps up in trip and as the year goes on, because he is a, a slow maturing horse. And then Hibernicus, who's just run the twice and won both starts, albeit in very small, relatively uncompetitive races, and he's got a handicap rating of 90, so he hasn't even graduated yet into to level weights races, but um, you know, it's not impossible that he would, so it's nice to have, have four possibles in there and, as I say, two of them well proven at that level. Mm, and a good Yorkshire Classic, presumably a race you'd be very keen to... Uh, I'd be delighted to win it, you know, fantastic. You know, ran third with double trigger all those years ago and um, it's, it's, it's a race that, you know, really, it's a surprise. Yeah, you can never say a surprise not to have won something as tough as this in Ledger, but uh, I think if, if people had said at the beginning of my career, which classic was I most likely to win, they'd probably have said the St Ledger because I've always been sort of mm. considered to have strong hand in the stairs um, and we've only, we've been placed twice or well, maybe three times uh, but it's still eluded us and it would be great to win it.